Hi everyone, so today I am going to be doing a drugstore haul. I stopped by um, my local Walgreens and I picked up quite a bit of stuff. Some stuff I needed and some stuff just caught my eye. So, let me jump in. We'll start with the things I needed. Um, the first thing I needed was these Aveeno Positive, Positively Radiant Makeup Removing Wipes. These are uh, these are my all-time favorite makeup remover wipes. They remove all of my makeup, and they smell so good. Oh, I got lipstick on it. Whoops. Um, but they smell delicious. I recommend these so much. They are amazing. I've gone through like 10 packs of these. I can't get enough. I love them so much. <laughs> I needed to pick up, this is the last thing I needed to pick up, um, is this uh, Fit Me Concealer by Maybelline. I go through these like crazy and I just, let me see if it, there we go. I just ran out. Um, I get it in 15 fair. I want the fairest one but 10 is a shade lighter than this and I think this one is lighter than the shade 10 I don't know why but so I get 15 and it's light enough for me okay now for the stuff that I didn't need um, the first things that I picked up were these wet and wild nail polishes I have this shade on my fingernails right now. I really like it. Um, I've tried these nail polishes before. These are just their spring collection. Um, this one is in Breeze On By. This one is in Love Fest. And then this one is Kiss My Mint. There was one more shade that they came out with. It was a lavender shade. But I have so many lavender shades, so I decided to pass. Um, another nail polish I got is, I have a few of these, um, the Wet n Wild new One Step Wonder Gels. But I decided to pick up this pink one. Then I realized they're the same shade. One, this one's just in a gel. This one's not. Um, but this shade is in Pinky Swear. I've tried these gels and I really like them. They work really well and they're inexpensive for what you're getting. Okay, next thing is the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte Foundation. I got mine in Shell Beige. I know that this has been out for a while, but I've been meaning to pick it up. And I finally got it, and I'm so excited to try it. I saw these shampoo and conditioner by Garnier. They're called Whole Blends. I got mine in Honey Treasures. Um, they smell delicious. It says that it strengthens and heals damage. So my hair could always use some healing, always. So I figured I'd pick them up. They were only $3.99 a piece. So, we'll see how that goes. Another item I got by Wet n Wild is their felt tip eyeliner. I picked this up because I heard that it was good and Wet n Wild is so cheap and I heard a lot of their new stuff that they came out with is so good. I'm going to swatch it. Wow, super duper 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 black. Um, I like felt tip liners. They just are easier for me than just the liquid liners, which is the normal brushes. So I, they have this. They have like a marker one, and then they also have a liquid one. But I picked up picked up the felt tip one, and it looks like it's gonna be a hit. <laughs> the last thing that I got from Wet n Wild is this instant flawless complexion um 
highlighting highlighting and concealing pen mine is in ivory into you this is another one of their new products that I wanted to try I can always use highlighting under the eye let's rip this bad boy open Maybe, maybe not. Ooh. Okay. Ten minutes later. I got it. Okay, so it's just like this. You twist it up until the product comes out. Twist and twist and twist and twist and twist and twist. Oh, I see it. Come on. Very soft. You can't see it. That's concealer. But it feels very nice. And this was, I think this was $4.99 for the highlighting pen. I got um, another thing from Maybelline. I got their new um, Master Fix Setting and Perfecting Loose Powder. I heard um, good things about this also you know everybody came out with reviews for all these new products so I've heard all of them and now I'm just kind of picking them up for myself I've heard all about all of them heard the reviews you know so I'm just kind of I'm sure they're all gonna be good because I didn't just randomly pick up any I picked them all up based on the reviews that they had on YouTube but try it out anyways Oh, this is very soft and it doesn't seem like it has like a a white cast it has a little bit of glitter in it I don't know if that'll show up on the skin or not because I know the elf one um, I heard has some glitter in it their mineral powder um, but it doesn't show up on the face so maybe this will be do the same thing maybe another thing thing I picked up is the new CoverGirl True Naked Roses palette. They have the Goldens and then they have the Nudes and I have a lot of Nudes and I have a lot of Goldens so I went for the Roses one. Let me pop it open. Here are some swatches of the shades from the CoverGirl Roses palette. They are super duper pigmented. They're also super, look at this. <laughs> Super soft and powdery. So, they're going to be very blendable, but I just hope when you blend them out, the pigmentation is still just as good. And it doesn't go away too fast. But they're super soft and very, very blendable. Very, very blendable. Okay. I... I got um, two of the L'Oreal Single Shadows that they came out with. This one is 210. Here's a swatch of it this right here it's just a nice light like shimmery frosty blue yeah and then this one in 213 is just like a teal color a greeny teal color very pretty that's what it swatches as they're very, they're soft also, not as powdery as the CoverGirl ones, but still very pigmented and still very soft and blendable. The L'Oreal ones are a little, like, jellier. I don't know. Weird. Okay. And then the last thing I picked up is the L'Oreal Infallible Matte Matic, and I got mine in Ultra Black. It's just a normal retractable eyeliner. 
if it's matte. Kind of like a coal eyeliner right here. It's creamy, but it's matte. We'll see if it how long it's actually stayed. Oh, oh my gosh. I just painted my nail. Look. We'll see how um good it stays on the waterline and stuff. So that's all that I have for you today. I hope you enjoyed my haul. Um, I'm really excited to try out these products. I've heard a lot of good things on them and the drugstore came out with a lot of new stuff. So it's cool to pick up some of the new things that they came out with and test them and compare them to products I already have. Yeah, so um, if you like this video, if you like drugstore hauls, give this video a thumbs up. I should draw little faces on my thumbs. Give this video a thumbs up and please don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you next time.